everyone, this is Rabbit Key New Zealand and I thought I would just do a little video for you because I did a recent order from Viavit and it arrived on Friday. Um, so I thought I would do a video for you today just to show you what I've got. Um, it's quite small, it was just a bit of a top up of stuff that I know the bunnies really like. Um, I've kind of bought quite a lot from Viavit now so I've got a, I kind of know what they like and what they don't like. So starting to do like double orders and reordering things that I know that are going to go down well with the bunnies and um, I had to order a little bit of food as well so um, I'll let you know how much it was in um, pounds and then I'll try and convert it to dollars just to show you how much it costs um, so first off um, I did open this one because I've been feeding it to the bunnies but um, I got another box of the Fibre First um, Unique Hay Based Nutrition for Rabbits. So this one I bought a while ago with the Selective Food and some treats just to try it out with the rabbits. Um, it's something a little bit different. It's kind of a treat but it's quite healthy. It's very very high in fibre. I think it's like 30% so really good for the gut which I um, have to always be careful with the Dustin because he's a bit sensitive so I thought it'd be a good food to have with him and since I bought my first box it went down really well. The rabbits really like it. And it's something nice I can give them in the evening instead of just pellets. And it just helps me not go through my Burgess pellets so quickly. So I give them a couple of these in the evening sometimes. And it's just something for them to chew on. It takes them a little bit longer. And it's um, nice and long pieces that are good for the gut. I'll show you what it looks like if you haven't seen my other video. Um, I can get it out of this box. So it's kind of like... You can see they're like long pellets, a couple of centimetres long, so they're really, really um, good quality food, nice high fibre content like I said, so it's something nice to try with the bunnies and they seem to really like it. So I got a box of that and that is 500 grams, so you can get it in a kg option, but because we're shipping to New Zealand, if you want to keep shipping at $20, you have to only have a 2 kg box, so I didn't want to buy use up all my 2 kgs on food so I thought I'd only get a 500 gram and the 500 gram box lasted me for quite a while so the next thing I got was this Naturals Chill and Chew Matte by Rosewood um, Water Hyanth Matte and it is 100% um, glue and staple free and it all safe to nibble this matte I bought a while ago and Bella absolutely loves it like I didn't put it in their cage because I knew it would get destroyed way too quickly. But I put it in their um, play area and every time she'd be out of her cage, she'd be running straight for it and started chewing on it. So it lasted a, quite a while but because um, it's actually reasonably tough, but she absolutely adored that. So I thought I would buy her another one of those because she really, really likes it. Um, I got my normal pack of three... Trio Fun Balls from Rosewood again, Naturals. Um, so you've got a Willow Ball, a Seagrass Ball, and a Hyanth Ball. The Hyanth Ball is the favourite. Um, Dustin really, really likes that. But these two, they usually have a good nibble on as well. I did actually buy two of these packets. Um, but one of them was for my, one of my friend's rabbits. So I gave that packet to her. So this is the one I'm keeping. Because I have still quite a lot. So, um, But I always buy a packet of those because they're actually a really good toy. Um, to get from Viavit and the rabbits always always really like them. So um, just to do pricing for the fiber first um, It was three pounds ninety eight. So that was about seven dollars um, for the board and breaker fun balls the trio three pounds forty so about seven dollars again um, and I got two of those so and then for the mat it was two dollars or two pounds thirty nine, so about five dollars there. So that's pretty good for something like that. As I've said in my videos before, if this stuff was actually sold in New Zealand, it would be very overly priced. So I'm quite happy to pay that. Um, next thing I got was a packet of willow sticks because the bunnies really, really like these. They are a different brand, they're Nature's First because the other brand that I got last time were out of stock. Um, so yeah, I thought that would be quite good to try, um, and they absolutely love the willow sticks, so I tend to just chuck a few in every time I do a cage clean and give them new toys, they get um, one or two willow sticks to have a bit of a chomp on, and the willow sticks were a pound eighty-five, so 
two or three dollars, which is pretty good. There's a lot in there, and that will last me quite a long time as well. All right, next thing I got was a couple of balls. So I got this Small and Furries Nature Ball, perfect playtime toy for your cat, and it's just a little ball made from, what have we got? Seagrass material with a little bit of a bell in it. So I know that the bunnies really like this material, so I'm pretty sure they'll they'll quite happily have a chew on that. And um, Bella especially likes jingly balls, and she likes to throw them around. So um, I think she'll quite like that that's a little bit noisier. And that one was a pound twenty-five, so about $3. And last of all, I got this big ball from Rosewood again, or Board and Breakers Naturals, Rattan Wobble Ball Large. So I bought this purely because in this packet, the Rattan one there is the favorite. The bunnies absolutely love that. So when I read this on Viber, it didn't have a picture. It just was because it's in one of those, um, they have a whole choice of different balls and it just had a picture of a generic one. So when I saw this, I was like, yes, I will get a giant Rattan ball and hopefully Dustin won't destroy it as quickly as the little one and he will love it. And then it arrived and it's actually not fully Rattan. It's got a Rattan ball inside it and it's got a willow casing. So it's not exactly what I hoped for, but it's still really cool. It's huge, you know, like it's about a bit bigger than my hand. And um, I still think they really like it, but I was a little bit hoping that it would be fully made out of this material here, which, you know, it's not, and maybe they just don't do that. But yeah, I am still think it will be a, a winner with the bunnies. And that one, Rat and Wobble, was three pounds and seven p. So yeah, six dollars, just over six dollars, which is pretty good. Like I said, if that was here in New Zealand, we'd probably charge like twice that for it. So quite happy with that. So yeah, that's kind of what I got. Um, like I said, I'm just starting now to do orders with things that I know the bunnies like because I've had a few. Um, I've purchased a few things that they haven't been overly keen on, and it's kind of been a bit of a waste of money. So. Um, I will probably do, I was thinking of doing a video um, about uh, recommending what Vivet toys I would personally get for my pets, um, especially if you're ordering from overseas and not in the UK because it costs quite a bit to get it shipped here and if you only get 2 kgs you want to do it right. Um, so I might just do a, a bit of a video for those for those people who want to try, who live, you know, kind of out outside of the UK um, in New Zealand and Australia and things like that who want to try it out. Um, but also want to have an idea of what they what would be a good thing to start with. So I might do a video on that just to show you guys. And I will do a redone diet video to show you the fibre first and how I use that. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and thank you for watching. Bye!